Well, today is Father's Day, and several organizations spent the day honoring and thanking fathers and father figures in North Texas. Fox News Rebecca Butcher spoke with the Concord Church in Dallas about how Edie is celebrating the dads in our lives. Rebecca? Yeah, Blake. Well, uh, Concord Church Dallas, they put on this event today. It's a day honoring our fathers and for all the fathers, the granddads and the father figures, everyone who came out, they were appreciated in every sense of the word. A dad? He likes working on cars. He spends a lot of time outside. A hero. Being present is, is a thing that I... I necessarily didn't necessarily get as much as I would like to using that information that I kind of as a negative changing and turning into a positive. Chrislyn and her mother are talking about Deltrick Morris, husband, father, and role model. Thankful for uh, him being present and uh, being an active dad, helping out with uh, extracurricular activities, drop off, pick up. Uh, helping out towards fixing things around the house. Kendra praises her husband for the many handy fixes he does in their home, which she says is appreciated and saves them money. Fathers, father figures, and granddads were celebrated today at Concord Church Dallas for the love and strength they bring to their families. At least several hundred families celebrated together. <laughs> And they continue to positively impact their community with their words and deeds. The Bible guides us in one way, and then and also we use our community, and it starts at home. So normally a man in a home helps bring up the family. The Heroes Foundation and the Mark Cuban Foundation presented the event. The message was about keeping and sharing the faith. We want to make sure that we celebrate them because the world tries to call dads out, but here at Concord, we're here to call dads up. And celebrate they did with a car show food truck and photo booth for families to remember the day. My dad was an incredible dad and I have a two year old son myself. And so one of the things that we're trying to make sure that we that we have is that your legacy is not just tangible, but it's intangible. Yeah, some special fathers that we uh, met out there today. So glad we got a chance to catch up with that church. Uh, also, to the assistant pastor, also reemphasize the fact that the legacy just goes beyond you and your family.